Special IRS agent, Pasco. Chief Gunza, how can I help you? You pay your taxes? Damn straight. Whoa, Gunza, I'm running into a problem with this case that I've been trying to solve. I'm running out of leads, and I was wondering if you could help me out. You should go speak to my man, Kutch. He's outside waiting on his new partner. Thank you. Welcome. You, Kutch? Yeah. Good to finally see you. If I'm being quite honest with you, this, this position is going to be one hell of a thing to fill. Last partner got mauled by monkeys with turbo aids. Um, uh, I'm not really sure you understand what I'm here for. I'm here to talk Hold to you about... Hold that thought. I have a phone call to take. Uh, well... I uh huh yeah um okay gotcha we have a twenty three nineteen what's that tax evasion mega homicide. Dick Kutch. I don't play by the rules. Prince Suave. Agent Pasco, do you pay your taxes? I do. Well, sorry to disturb you so, uh, you know, abruptly, but I need to ask, do you know anything about this mega homicide that I should know about? It, it all happened so fast, I didn't even get to see the perpetrator. Oh God. All I know is that there were wheelchair tracks left behind. Wheelchair tracks. Anything else you can tell me, you know, like I said, it all happened too fast. Um, I've got a kingdom to run, man, you know. I've got to get going. All right, well, I appreciate you for your time. Yep. Stop by the kingdom someday. Oh, yeah. Kutch, I don't play by the book. Wittiness. Agent Pasco, do you pay your taxes? Um, yeah, I'll do them tomorrow. Sorry to bother you, but uh, gotta ask about this uh, super turbo homicide. Do you know anything about that? Um, I've barely seen anything. I had just gotten there. All I know is that someone had found false teeth on the scene. False teeth, huh? Sounds like somebody needs a better dental plan. This is definitely some evidence we can crunch on. Well, is there anything else you could tell us, maybe? Um, nah, I mean, I've got to get to cleaning those weapons, guys, so that's all I got. All right, well, thank you for your time. You have yourself a great day. Excuse me, sir. Detective Kutch, I don't play by the rules. Rico Harbor. Agent Pasco, do you pay your taxes? What can I help you guys with? Well, we're looking into uh, this Mega Turbo Homicide Pro Max. Is there anything you can tell me about that? Um, autopsy report indicates the use of a cane, but that's all I could find, man. Like, huh? Cane, huh? Well. Looks like without that, they won't be getting too far. But it sounds like somebody met their early retirement. All right, let's go. Good luck, SS. So, I can't seem to wrap my head around this. We have the palace, the armory, and Rico's house. But the only thing that circles around that is an old retirement home. But there is a metal shop right next to it. And they haven't been paying their taxes as of recent. Been meaning to go audit that place. Clearly, that is where we are going. Buckle up, because I don't play by the book.
Sounds like somebody who would cover up a homicide. Yeah, screw rights. I don't play by the book. You're under arrest. <laughs> I gotta say, Detective Kutch, you definitely know how to close a case. And you know, I gotta say, you're pretty good for a cop as an IRS agent. I never did ask. Do you pay your taxes? <laughs> what do you take me for? No, I don't play by the book. Look, it's been nice working with you. You're coming with me. Oh, no. How did this happen? I didn't play by the book. All right, understood. Turns out, Mimo the Trick Dog was the real perpetrator. Apparently, Mimo was famous for riding around in his famous Mimo wheelchair, juggling false teeth, and swinging canes around. Just another case solved by Detective Kutch. As for the guy we arrested, he got what he deserved. I, however, am free to go, because I don't play by the book. Thank you